Hello and welcome back to Snacks Bag. I think I don't remember the name apparently, and I was just looking at the snacks perk and wanted to say that. Oh well. Wait, someone wanted it, or was I supposed to catch it only? Let's see. Oh, MG, you got everything in Gather Grove. You haven't found a few I've never seen before. Cop hoppers are so weird, little LOL. Thanks for sharing. Hey, buddy. Guys, I have another letter from the river, buddy. Any idea who might have written this one? Paja Takroach. Healthy training. Feed a Paja Takroach the mystery grumpus. I haven't seen that one yet. Thank you very much. Let's okay, and let's go visit uh, shack. This shack, yeah, because I don't. It's number four. No. Nothing else. Chest. Just for this one. Yep. Oh, that's number three. Great. Just what I was missing. Egg pass are gonna be there. I know things are tough with Liz right now. But dog, she loves you. You two will be back to normal in no time. But I don't wanna go back to normal. I don't want her worrying about me anymore. <laughs> when you love somebody, you never stop worrying about her. I know. And I'm worried about her too. I just wanna take better care of her. And that starts with me. I get that. I will get you there. Thanks, Chandlo. And, uh... Ooh, maybe I'll hit the showers after all. I smell rotten. Oh, good. Uh, let's go with the interview first, then we'll go well, have about... Have time for an interview? Are you mad? I can't have my secrets plastered all over the front page news. Don't... What if your name wasn't attached? Hmm. I suppose I can reveal a tad bit, so long as my identity is protected. Cool. I'm fine with that. <laughs> Who are you? <clears throat> I am Snorp Redacted. Bean. 
and I have devoted my life to inventing devices that foil the machinations of the Grumpinati. Why come to Snacktooth Island? Well, I was dragged here by my dearest friend, Cha- Redacted. He thought I needed some fresh air or something. Much as I hate the outdoors, I simply can't say no to him. How long have you been, uh, you and Redacted have been in a relationship? Well, I, well, I, I, I mean, we've been together since kindergarten. It would make perfect sense if we were together together. He's never said we are, has he? Thoughts on bug snacks. I surmise they are some sort of synthetic life form designed to beguile our taste buds. If bug snacks are artificial, where do they come from? I'm so glad you asked. I believe there may be a factory located on this very island, hidden somewhere deep underground. I have charts. Let me show you my charts later. Why did you leave town? I was too exposed. Floofty tried to wrap me up in their experiments, now that Lizbert and Agabel weren't around to occupy them. I could see that this was the next step in the Grumpinati's plot against me. Grumpinati's plot. Lizbert disappears, we are hit with an earthquake, we suffer a snack shortage, all that in one day? Do you really think those are all coincidences? The timeline is on my charts. An info on Lizbert. Elizabeth Megafig was a curious sort, and had a foolish bone in her body. She could rival me in wits, and chat redacted. Blow and arm wrestling. We would share secrets now and again. Dreadful. Terrible secrets. What terrible secrets? <laughs> I'm not telling you the terrible secrets because they are terrible and secret. I think we're done here. Excellent interrogation, chum. So great that you deserve another hugging experience. No. Ah. <laughs> This must not go on the record. Elizabeth Megafig discovered something on the island and came to me for help. An entrance to the underground, locked behind a strange device. I assisted her in unraveling its secrets, and soon after, she vanished. You must take extreme caution. I can tell you where to find it, but the rest is up to you. I think I know where it is. It's not give you a map to mystery door. Check your journal for details. I think I found it already. Thank you, Snoppy. Hmm, let's see. Chando, you wanted something. Oh, there you are. Sup? Hi. You need help? Yeah, dog. I'm trying to pull up this stump so I can build a bebop cord. I'm about as swole as a grumpus can get, and I can't move this thing at all. I gotta be stronger than a grumpus. I gotta push my limits, you feel me? Mm. I feel ya. Uh, I need your help to bulk up. If you go find the biggest, buffest bug snacks around, and I eat them, maybe I'll gain their strength. And catch aggressive meat, meaty bug snacks. That gives me no info. Um, okay, uh, you. Hey, buddy. We've almost got everybody. You're doing a great job, buddy. But hey, don't forget to take care of yourself. In fact, maybe you should turn in early today and just relax. Oh, good idea. I guess. Huh. Something's wrong, buddy. We better take a look. Okay, lead the way. Bevica, Gramble, what happened? We saw something real spooky walk right into town. I thought it was a grumpus at first, but like something about it was wrong. Was this creature wearing a crown by any chance? Or was it perhaps holding some sort of ceremonial dagger? What? No, no nothing like that. It looked kind of normal until it... Oh, until it... It turned into a bunch of bug snacks and like scattered. Frankly, I find that hard to swallow. Uh, what a load, Biff. Not enough drama around town for you lately, huh? Zonk off, Cromdo. Unlike you, I don't lie for a living. Oh, wow. So tell me then, what were you doing skulking around at midnight? Breaking into huts? Again? I seen it too. And this time I know it's not just one of my nightmares. Get some grump and sleep, Gramble. I can't. 
Not with all of y'all around here with your hungry mouths. Don't take this the wrong way, darling, but you are a bit high strung. A little beauty sleep would do you wonders. Maybe then you'd finally let us eat a few pets. You say that again. Oh, get off me. Stop. Whoa, hey, chill the grump out, bros. There's no need for all that. If what Gramble and Befica are saying is true, there's got to be some physical evidence left behind, yeah? Indeed. We should sweep the perimeter and keep watch in case the creature returns. Um, uh, good idea. Uh, buddy, do you think you can scope out the restroom? You know, find out what they saw? <laughs> okay, I guess. That's like I have any no choice. Messy pool like prince lead from the edge of Snacksburg to the garden. Wampus does his best to grow buck snacks. A rusty spade is guarded near the sign. Smells like snacks. The words no more buck snacks are carved crudely into the campsite. This log has been busted open. Something got inside the ranch. Grumble needs all of his own clothes and accessories. Okay, nothing in here. The finest portable music seems to blink to Crumble. Okay, we can't get that out. Wait, what was that? Oh. Can I? Nope. All I can do is scan things around, so... More paw prints. Okay. Bug prints. Bug snack tracks scattered from here. Where the Krampus tracks stop. You found what you were looking for? All right, I'll call everybody together. Yes, I'm ready. Well, w w what did you find? There are trucks that aren't quite like, uh, aren't quite grumpus. Well, that's, um, I reckon there's got to be some other explanation. Cram it, Wampo, we got a genuine monster on our paws. Hmm, monster's a bit of a prejudicial term, don't you think? I'd call it more of a cryptid, or undiscovered animal. It's no animal, darling. We're witnessing the queen of bug snacks in action. She's given us a warning! Oh, that is absurd. Which is more likely, that a so far unseen giant bug snack politely left a note on our door, or that this is some form of coordinated gaslighting by the Grumpenar- What's more likely, dear, is that you've watched far too many movies. Well, at least my theory has scientific data behind it, whereas you haven't even drawn one chart. I was top of the charts, thank you. Whoa, 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 whoa. You know what? Let's split the difference, eh? You're both wrong. Uh, what does it even matter? Whatever it is, it wants us dead. Between this and the earthquakes, Snacksburg's becoming pretty unlivable. I hate to say it, bro, but I regret coming down from the mountain. Me and Snorpy were a lot safer before we came back. Same goes for me and my little ones. Oh, no, no, we shouldn't split up again. We're better off if we're all here together. That might have been true when Lisbert was around, but those days are long gone. You don't know that. She might come back. Yeah, <laughs> don't hold your breath, pal. Face it, Philbo. Without Lisbert, all we have is you. That's... that's... not true. Listen, I don't know why Lisbert put me in charge, but I do know this. None of you were really happy out there alone. We don't have Lisbert, but we have each other. Maybe if we try, we could all add up to one of her. Uh, I guess you're not wrong. So we're all staying in town then? Seems like it, as long as we can watch each other's backs. If we're gonna make it, we need everybody here. 
Floofty and Sheldar are still out there, and, and, and who knows if they're safe? If you must find Floofty, according to the tracking device I placed on them, they're out by Boiling Bay. And last time I saw Sheldar, she was meditating in the sizzling sands. But don't forget about Egabel. If she's not with Lisbert, we gotta find her. We will, Chandlo. And once we do, we'll throw a big welcome back party. How does that sound? Okay. Great! Now, let's go get some sleep. Sure, yeah. Mm -hmm. I have no idea where the bowling bait is. Well, I think I can, again, I can guess. To what do I owe the honor? Um, I'm just curious what you think you're doing here. What am I doing? I'm working the counter. Cromdomart's back in business, baby. Don't act all innocent. If you start running scams again, I'll know. Yeah, yeah, because you know everything. And here's what I know. You're not better than me, Beth. Nobody likes all you snooping around. <laughs> I don't care what they think about me, as long as I make sure you get what you deserve. <laughs> don't I always? Are you going to buy something or what? Yeah, I'll take a tall snack water extra fizz. Coming right up. Okay, hi. Have time for an interview? All right, I could use some practice. They'll be interviewing me every day when I'm a gazillionaire. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Who are you? Business King, Sales Savant, future CEO of Starbucks, the one, the only, Crondo Face! Why come to Snack of Island? You ever smell the future, kid? Huh? I can tell you, Lisbeth stank of opportunity. She came on TV talking big about this new superfood, and I wanted in. So I quit my dead end job and followed that stench of possibility. What was your dead end job? Uh, I used to go door to door selling gruel to grandmas, paid on commission for grump's sake. For some back snacks. <laughs> what do I think of? <laughs> Delicious! Irresistible! Marketable! They're gonna catapult me straight to the top of Money Town, baby! Why did you leave town? Yeah, I tried to make use of what Lisbeth didn't need anymore, and Befica didn't like that. Yeah, she went and told everyone that I'm a thief. Weren't you stealing? I was salvaging! That's a community service, pal! But Befica planted evidence in my hut, said I stole her diary, so I did what any honest grump would do. I ran. And then from Lisbeth. Oh, don't get me started. Everyone here thinks she's so great, such a fantastic leader. But I know the truth. She came here to stroke her ego and get Egabel her fix. The rest of us were just pss, disposable. Disposable. That's pretty cold. That's Elizabeth Megafig. When push came to shove, she abandoned us. What do you mean? I, I gotta confess, I was thinking about sailing home after things got hairy. But when I went looking for our boat, it was gone. There's only two grumps missing. You do the math. <laughs> I bet Liz and Egg are living large in New Grump City by now. Calm down, Crumdo. That's enough for now. Yeah, 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 yeah. I get it, pal. I'm not the nicest grumpus around. I learned early on that life is like a box of trash. You always know what you're gonna get. Trash. Just go check out where the boat was. See what you think of Lisbeth after that. Chromodo gave you a map to the boat. Check your journal for details. Right, and we have another one as well. It's over here. Over here. No. Uh, here. <laughs> Near the mountain peak, hang left from the trail and take a narrow ledge north. See at that map. Okay, that's one mystery map. The soul spur looking down on calm from between the trees beneath the snow line. So that, so that. At the end of 
the bowling bay past the shipwreck. Please, was flying over there. Okay, let's start with this near the mountain peak. Hang left. Uh, the mountain peak, you say? Oh, right, and am I supposed to. Wait, 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 wait. Because I forgot where this lone tree was. Isn't there anymore? There it is. But I cannot get my stuff out, so I have to jump over there. Oh, that's gonna be tricky. Um, unless... No, I really cannot use anything in this town. There's no way I'm getting that from that place. Maybe from there. Wait, wait, wait. What's... Wait, wait, wait. I saw... Oh, it was a pillow. Hmm. Okay, I have no idea how to get that. So, hmm. Want something? Hey, mind your own... Lou, you look like you're scheming. Oops. Hey, pal. I got a business opportunity for you. Of course. I got a tip that Triffany found some sort of treasure map while she was digging around. They say it'll lead to a huge bug snack. Imagine what a snack that size is worth. I was thinking of taking that map off her paws. That's where you come in. Get me a bug snack so delicious that Triffany would die for it and we'll trade. Then we'll split the profits 50-50. Did you say 50? I clearly said 50. <laughs> Catch a buffalo cast. I have no idea what that is. Huh. Wait, what? Sire. Yard. Sard. Okay. Nope. Um. Ah! There's some back playing in here. Leave Luigi. me alone. How is it going, Snoopy? Ah, chum. Good to see you on this ordinary tyranny-free day. Let us talk pleasantly of the weathers. Yes, the weathers. I've discovered something terrible. My seismic readings show that activity in the mountain is growing stronger and more frequent over time. We must find the source of the quakes before the situation grows out of control. There is an unusually large bug snack on the mountain that I'm certain is involved. The formidable Scoopy Banoopy. Disassemble it and dispose of the components in my mouth, and once more we will have thwarted the Grumpanati. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Wait, I think I saw it. No, I don't think I saw it. Um, How's it going? Hey, wait, wait, where are you going? <sighs> hey, Wiggle. Hello. I think, I think I wanted something as well. Wait, didn't you want How something? You... What did you want again? You go find the big. All oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess. I remember now. Hi. Do... How was your research? Oh, I dug up yes. this journal out in the. I yes. want to follow. Sounds lovely. Oh, you're the first place of note is in Flavor Falls. Meet me there whenever's good for you. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. What? That's not very convenient for me. Okay. Alrighty. What we're Whatever. looking for is a big stone grumpus face and a bug snack called a pinkle. Let's look around. Um. Okay, apparently she's not bothered by anything. She's not over there. No, I don't think it was over here. It was! That's the face. Feed her pinkle. 
Feed you a pinko. I found the strong grumpus. There would be the work of the ancient stone grumps, a civilization from over 5,000 years ago. All that's left to them is statuary and some puzzling mechanisms. Unlike the desert grumps, these folks didn't preserve their dead. In fact, the writer thinks they would sacrifice him to the bug snacks, like an offering to the gods and whatnot. This means bug snacks may be a more lasting legacy than any of the stuff they built. Okay. Bye now. And you want to eat. Well, oh, right here in the water. Unless... Nope. Actually... Are you kidding me? I was curious about that. And I wanted to get rid of it. <laughs> oh, that should take care of that. This one. Yep, it did. You might have noticed pinkle statues scattered around here. These must have been an important food source to the ancient grumps. That's everything, right? Well, I was hoping to find a camp of some sort. Maybe a corpse or two. But oh well, there's plenty more spots to check out. Let's head back to Snacksburg for now. Oh, you won't teleport me now? That's a bummer. Ah, actually, I'm just gonna go like this. And there's something over here. Oh. And actually, I think that's gonna be it for today. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!